I'm really excited to meet Leslie today, just to see her yeah. personality and her. Ahem! Oh. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Hola! Hi. Que pasa? <laughs> today you're going to meet Leslie. She's a lot of fun. Leslie makes me laugh all the time. She will make fun of me about something and I will make fun of her. And we both genuinely think it's funny. I'm so excited. I'm excited to meet her. I'm so excited. When I think about Leslie, I think of her sense of humor. Her energy is infectious. If Leslie didn't fit in with my family, I'd be stunned. Wow. Oh, man, it seems like forever since I've seen you. I know. You know what? Oh. Oh. Today I'm meeting Gary's family, and right now I feel very confident. Last time I saw Gary was in the Fantasy Suite Day where we spent hours talking. He said that he wanted to be with me in so many words, that I was the one. Hi! <laughs> oh my God! I know that what we have is special, and I don't think it could be duplicated. Wait, take this. I can give good hug. Thank you. I just feel like I really need to be myself. Gary fell in love with me being myself, so I'm hoping his kids and grandkids do the same. So, how's it all been? How's oh, the journey been? So fun? So much fun. My whole thing is I made him laugh and like he got my humor, which is really important to me because not everybody thinks I'm funny. <laughs> um, but Gary does, so that's good. <laughs> that's all that matters. <laughs> that's all that matters. I don't know, we've always had fun together. You know, you look up to The Bachelor and you're like, oh, he's kind of prim and proper. I think the best time for me was on our overnight date. All of a sudden, he said the word <laughs> And I was like, yes, I can swear in front of him. Right. <laughs> this is great. You're like, this is eye-opening. I want to clarify that the word had an exclamation point. No, it wasn't. It, it, not it, a question mark. No. No. Oh my God. I'm so sorry. I should have just said stop. Just stop. it. Was... <laughs> Seeing Leslie and Dad laughing and being playful was a breath of fresh air today, it, only because the way he communicates with people is through joking around. Leslie, do you want to go chat for a minute? I would love to. So the interaction that I was seeing was more what I would picture him doing with his partner. Yeah, so how are you feeling? <sighs> I am nervous, happy, excited, scared to death. Mm -hmm. I am crazy about your grandfather. I love him and I, I want to go through life with him. I, I can see that. Everything about him, you know, he's very heartfelt and sincere. He's just a very good person. <laughs> Sorry. I think it just is huge for us that like you are seeing this in him because we have always seen this in him. So just to hear that it's reciprocated and that there is like so much love going around is just great to hear. Mm -hmm. So after we met Teresa, I loved her. Charlie loved her. Know, yeah. we, we had our hearts set on Teresa and now Ooh, like Leslie, she's great. I got so emotional about it and I think that that spoke volumes to me. One of the things that him and mom always talked about was retiring and being able to go and travel. Well, I, I love, I mean, that's all I ever want to do is yeah. to travel and see the world and enjoy life. I guess I'm just curious as to where your feelings are with regards to a proposal. Would you want a proposal? Um, so the other day, you know, he said to me, do you think this can work? I said, absolutely. And he goes, till death do us part. And I said, yes. And then that anxiety yep. because... It's a lot. Well, this is getting it's, real. It's a lot. <laughs> yeah. And, you know, honestly, I've never had that right. in my life. He has. And it scared me a little bit. Yeah. And I talked about it with him. And I basically said, I've never committed, not by my choosing, to one person. Mm -hmm. You know, I've had... Uh, the relationships, I've been married twice. I wanted that, it just didn't work out. And of course, in Gary fashion, he made me feel really comfortable yeah. and secure. And then I like this calm came over me and I said, I, that's what I want too. Most of the time, things don't go exactly my way when it comes to relationships. But till death do his part, that's all I ever wanted. He is the man of my dreams. He really is. Hey, mom.
He is so special and an amazing person, and he really makes me happy. All right. <laughs> Been looking forward to this. Yeah. Well, we just had a great conversation in there. Good. Yeah. Good. Yeah, it was really good. You got a great first impression. She's so fun, and I love being with her. I do kind of like her, like, free-spiritedness. To me, that's a little endearing, you know, when, when people just kind of let their thoughts fly and go with it. Yeah, and she did get pretty emotional in there. I do think she's got some really strong feelings. Um, it did make me question just a little bit, like, are you being emotional because you are still really struggling with this decision if my dad were to ask you to get married? I mean, what are your thoughts? How are you feeling leading up to tomorrow? This has been exhausting. I'm, I'm kind of getting, I don't want to say stressed out, but I've asked myself over and over again. I have these two wonderful women, mm -hmm. so I absolutely want to make sure that it's a woman that I can't live without, yep. and it's for the rest of my life. Yeah, I can't even, I don't want to be in your shoes. I do not envy you. Yeah. It, you have two great ladies. You really yeah. do. It, it, you know, in thinking about Teresa and Leslie, feeling like, you know, I had this weight on my chest. It's going to be you in that moment. Just what's your heart tell you? Yeah. I think the conversation with my daughters kind of woke me up to the fact that this is it. The biggest decision that I have made in the last 55 years. Bye, Andy. Goodbye. Enjoy. Everything up until this day, I've been able to be composed and organize my thoughts, rein in the emotions, and I'm, I'm not doing so good today with it. It's gotten confusing. It's gotten to the point where, uh, uh, at times, I don't know where I'm at. You ready? I'm ready. All right, here we go. Uh, I, I don't know how I'm going to handle this, and um, it, it, it's debilitating to think about it. I feel really good now after meeting your family. Good. So, mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. So it was great. Tonight we get to have a little more time. Yeah. And just you and I. Mm hmm Okay? Mm-hmm. All right. Yeah. So what do you think? Are you you ready to go? Mm -hmm. What do you think? <laughs> hmm? Well, I never want to leave. But <laughs> <laughs> well But I am looking forward to seeing you later. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah. It's Probably time for me to take off. Mm-hmm. Okay? Yep. All right, give me a big fat hug. Okay. All right. <sighs> Today went really, really well meeting Gary's daughters and granddaughters, but um, I feel like I can read Gary now, and I could tell he wasn't quite himself today. All right. Okay. I'll see you later. Okay. All right. Bye. Bye. Just his mannerisms were a little different, and so I'm just trying to calm myself down about it and not have the anxiety that I feel creeping in a little bit. I am putting myself out there, and so that's all I can do.